Shravni, do you know what Kavach is? You mean the Kavach and Kundal that Dandir Khan used to have in the Great Battle of Mahabharat? No, not that, but something similar. Okay, does this Kavach also protect just like Karnas did? Yes, this make our trains safe. It is India's first ever self-made anti-collision device. This is India's answer to the world, saving and protecting millions of daily train passengers' life. It is the safety system, revolutionizing the entire rail running system in India. Come with me to explore this cutting-edge technology called Kavach that ensures our safety as we travel in train through the length and breadth of this vast country called Bharat. So this is where our journey begins. I have reached Delhi Hazrat Nizamuddin Railway Station and I am going to take you to an exciting journey to Sikandrabad in Telangana. But let me tell you, this journey is not going to be just about beautiful scenery and delicious food. But we will also delve into the railway safety system and the incredible technology known as Kavach. So without wasting any more time, let's get going before our train leaves. Come. Indian Railways is the lifeline of our nation with 7,335 stations and an impressive track length of 1,26,000 km. Can you believe 23 million passengers travel daily? It is a massive operation including countless men and the machines. But safety has always been a concern and it took us a very long time to actually embrace the new technologies. Let's have a conversation with our co-passengers who are boarded on this train right now about their experience of travelling in the Indian Railways and also if they are aware about the anti-collusion protection system, Kavach. कि प्लेटफार्म पे लगाओ या फिर ट्रेन के अंदर लगाओ तो उसमें सुरक्षा का मुद्दा नहीं था लोग ध्यान नहीं देते इस चीज को क्योंकि परवाह में करते नहीं थे लेकिन अब जो है आज की तारीख में देखा जाए तो ये चीजें जो है हमें बहुत अच्छी लगी हैं पहले इतना ज्यादा सेफ्टी और सिक्योरिटी एंड क्लीनलीनेस ये सब तो नहीं था अब इतने सारे हेल्पलाइन नंबर हैं कि अगर आपको सेफ्टी के लिए कुछ नंबर चाहिए हैं तो वो भी प्रोवाइड किए हुए हैं क्लीनलीनेस के लिए नंबर हैं तो भी आजकल प्रोवाइड किए गए हैं पहले नहीं था इतना कुछ पर अब काफी है पहले से बहुत बेटर है क्योंकि पहले लोग जो है सफाई वगैरह बिल्कुल नहीं रहती थी अब पूरी तरह से सब सुविधाएं हैं in the past, we have seen some tragic train accidents like the devastating Firozabad accident in the year 1995, claiming 358 lives, underscoring the importance and the urgence of enhanced safety measures. Fast forward to today, in the last decade, Indian Railways have made remarkable strides reducing the accidents number from 473 in the year 2000 and 2001 to just 40 in the year 2023 and 2024 thanks to initiatives like 1 lakh crore Rashtriya Rail Sanraksha Kosh. Now let's talk about Kavach. It is an automatic train protection system designed as a safety shield for its passenger on board. Developed by the Indian companies, it monitors the train speed and also alerts the operator to potential danger. Pretty cool, isn't it? Now let's come and ask our co-passengers if they are aware about this advanced technology known as Kavach or not. Uh, sir, are you aware about this new technology called Kavach? If so, please tell us something about it. Yes, ma'am. Um, I heard about Kavach. Um, our railway minister has uh, announced uh, uh, Kavach technology, a uh, latest one. It is an anti-collision, anti-collision uh, train protection system. Yeah, protection. It will be of great use because it will save so many lives. Earlier, so many lives are lost. Hmm. So school buses have been met with accidents at unmanned gates, and two trains collided, and a lot of casualties are there. Now, all those things will be averted. Now. 
I am glad that this will surely reduce the accidents and we will have a safe journey. The journey of Kavach began in year 2016 with rigorous trials. By 2019, it achieved the highest global safety standard SIL4 certification. In 2020, it was officially approved as national ATP system. Finally, I have arrived at Sikandrabad where I'll get to see what Kavach really is and how is it saving lives of so many people every day. Here, in just few hours, I will sit right next to the local pilot and understand the functioning of Kavach, an experience like never before. It's day two today and the moment has finally come to have a first-hand experience of coverage. In a very short period of time, we will be inside the locomotive along with the local pilot and see the functioning of coverage. To address the issue of train derailment and collision, Indian Railways introduced coverage, Automatic Train Protection System developed by the Research Design and Standard Organization, in short RDSO, in collaboration with three Indian companies. To expedite the same, the government also roped in Japanese vendors to set up bases in India and provide scalability. The responsibility is immense as the slightest mistake can have devastating consequences, potentially costing thousands of lives. Hence, the railways is going the extra mile to ensure perfect execution of the same. The Kavach has been designed and developed under the best international signaling and safety specifications. It is important that indigenous technology is developed, deployed and promulgated by indigenous vendors. They have a very important role to play. The maintenance of the specification, maintenance of high standards of production and the scalability as per the speed of the deployment is a prime objective and the task which is carried out by the vendors. Indian Railways plans to implement coverage safety system across 44,000 kilometers, aiming to eliminate the fatalities caused by human error. It is a massive undertaking. It requires both technical advancement and infrastructural upgrade. But there are challenges. Indian Railway faces diverse range of terrain and weather conditions, making deployment of coverage crucial. It is just like refueling jet mid-air. This ambitious target set by the current government surpasses the entire passenger network of the United States, which spans over 35,000 km. This innovative safety system exemplifies Indian ingenuity and commitment to railway safety. This provides a layer of uh, safety in train operations, particularly eliminating the human errors uh, on the part of our drivers. While choosing the technology, while choosing the uh, various equipments, uh, a lot of care has been taken, keeping in mind the, the different type of environmental conditions prevailing over the entire Indian railways. Apart from this, uh, uh, this has been designed to Senelec, uh, that is European standards of safety integrity level 4. That is the highest uh, level of safety integrity. So this meets all our safety requirements as well as our environmental requirements. It's finally the time to board our locomotive and experience the functioning of coverage. We will also be talking to our local pilot and understand the basics of how the coverage works and save lives of so many people. Let's go! We have with us Mr. Mohan here, who is the coverage engineer, who's going to tell us uh, all about how coverage works while our journey. And right now, he's going to explain how the whole system is going to start. So, please uh, tell us. Uh, actually, uh, this particular coverage or technical called as TICA is an add on product of any loco, so which actually is a priority of safe side of the loco movement. So, it actually monitors the whole loco movement based on the information received from station side. Okay. This is a speedometer. It actually shows how much speed the loco has to travel at the time of movement. Okay. At the same time, it takes the input from the station 
based on that inputs only the loco need to go the regular speed if it avoids more than that speed automatically it is gonna apply brakes if a loco pilot misses out on to a signal then how will coverage help the locomotive to stop automatically so actually coverage is a prevention which controls the speed actually here so it brings back the loco for example loco is moving at maximum speed will loco pilot might not be able to control the speed it automatically applies a brake and brings to minimum speed till the span then loco pilot helps loco pilot to apply the brake and make the zero if in case loco pilot by mistake it overrides a uh, signal also he can has a mode here trip mode he can select the mode and he can move in a reception speed so we are going to see all these things what he has just explained live and let's start with our journey and this is this is going to be one of kind of an experience for all of us let's go so if you can see here the loco pilot has crossed the limit here it gives warning here if you acknowledge it's okay more than 5 km if you go for 90 here 90 km. so when it was going beyond the given numbers yes. so the uh, alarm went on now you manually have uh, acknowledged acknowledged that, that uh, it is all under control yes. if we do not acknowledge if the loco pilot did, uh, acknowledge then the machine is going to take over oh, yeah take over and it is going to apply brakes automatically this is the applying brakes because we are in exceeding the numbers okay Oh my god this was something really amazing we just saw the alarm went on and the loco pilot did not apply the brake but the train actually came at halt after crossing the red signal and we are all safe actually in the train it is amazing the progress has been nothing short of extraordinary optical fiber cable laying of 4055 kilometers of the proposed 6000 kilometers with 356 towers already installed additionally 273 station coverage installations have been completed track side equipment have been deployed across 1331 km and 301 locomotives are already equipped it is true that indian railway approach towards infrastructure and safety has undergone a significant transformation in the last decade Indeed the number of accidents have dropped in last few years but there is still a lot of work to be done to erase this number entirely the gross budgetary support for railways in financial year 2024-2025 stands at 2 lakh 52200 crore reflecting the government's emphasis on railway safety and infrastructure This investment has led to record achievements with Indian Railways reaching 1588 metric ton in freight loading during financial year 2023 and 24 up from 1095 metric ton in 2014 and 15 with a target of 3000 metric ton by the year 2030 Even Railway Minister Ashwini Vaishnav expressed gratitude to Prime Minister Modi and Finance Minister Nirmala Sitaraman for the substantial railway budget allocation. With a World Economic Forum rating of 4.4 in railroad infrastructure quality, India has surpassed many countries like UK, Belgium, Italy and Sweden despite handling the largest passenger load globally. Despite many hurdles and numerous challenges in modernizing Indian railways, initiatives like Kavach are leading the way in ensuring passenger safety and preventing accidents. India is now on track to deploy the world's largest automatic train protection system, positioning Indian railways as a global leader in safety, innovation and efficiency. As I wrap up my journey it is very clear that Indian Railways is setting up new standards in terms of safety and passenger experience and coverage is a testament to that commitment thank you so much for joining us in our journey as we move forward towards more safer and secure rail network in India i'm your host Riya signing off